Kickoff conversation uh, is the shortest chapter in the book. You sit the kids down for five or ten minutes, and you say, guys, things are going to be different around here, and you explain to him, them how counting is going to go. You say, part of this you're going to like, and part you're not going to like. You say, okay, what are we going to like? What you're going to like is, after you come out of timeout, we don't talk about it anymore, unless it's something new, unusual, or dangerous. And your kids will like that. These books, like the Super Nanny and some of the other ones, they want you to you know, put them on the naughty rug and then discuss it. And while the kid's on the naughty rug, they're supposed to, supposed to be constructing a behavioral plan that they're going to use to prevent that kind of misbehavior for the rest of their life. Give me a break, you know. Let's remember our, what kids are really like. You know, they come out, we don't talk about it unless it's new, unusual, or dangerous. And then they say, what are we not going to like? What you're not going to like is if you do something so bad right off the bat, like you slug somebody or use a real bad swear, uh, it's going to be an automatic three, and you're going to go straight to timeout. They won't like that. And then it's good to do a dress rehearsal. Usually if you have mom and dad in the same house, dad pretends that he's the acting up kid. Mom counts him, uh, and dad goes to timeout. And the kids giggle. And all that. They will not giggle when you count them, uh, but it does give them a feel for it. Oh, boy.